Florida's mild climate makes outdoor living a year-round option. Golf carts and low-speed vehicles can be a great way to enjoy and explore local communities. The Florida Department of Highway Safety and Motor Vehicles is here to help consumers understand the differences between these vehicles and the regulations that apply. Low-speed vehicles must be registered and titled, must have Florida auto insurance with personal injury protection and property damage liability coverage, must be operated by someone with a valid driver license, and may only be operated on streets where the posted speed limit is 35 miles per hour or less. Low-speed vehicles must have these safety features to be operated on public roadways. Golf carts are not required to be registered, titled, or insured, do not require a driver license to operate, and must only be operated by someone 14 years or older. Golf carts may only be operated on designated roadways with a posted speed limit of 30 miles per hour or less. Check with local authorities to see which roads are designated for golf cart travel before heading out on the road. Golf carts can be converted to low-speed vehicles. Prior to titling and registering, the vehicle must be inspected and assigned a vehicle identification number at an FLH SMV regional office. The converted golf cart must be street legal before applying. Make sure you understand the differences between golf carts and low-speed vehicles before you buy. No matter what type of vehicle you're driving, it's important to keep safety in mind. Be sure to obey all traffic safety laws to ensure that you arrive alive. For more information, visit flhsmv.gov. Brought to you by the Florida Department of Highway Safety and Motor Vehicles.